migration is having on his homeland, remarking, Ireland, we are at war in relation to the chronic housing shortage that has made basic living unaffordable for many citizens. Do not let any Irish property be took over unannounced. Evaporate said property, it's war. Following the stabbing of three children by an Al Algerian migrant in Dublin, the former UFC champion condemned authorities for targeting Irish people who staged fiery but mostly peaceful protest in response. Innocent children ruthlessly stabbed by a mentally deranged non-national in Dublin, Ireland today, he posted on X. Our chief of police had this to say on the riots in the aftermath. Drew, not good enough. There's grave danger among us in Ireland that should never be here in the first place. Oh yeah, he's in trouble. Connor's in big trouble. His posts are being ass ass assessed by the Irish police as part of an inquiry into dissemination of online hate speech. He's on the investigation, man. Damn, Connor. I got to keep your mouth shut over there in Europe, man. Oh, yeah, man. <laughs> in case you missed it, man. In case you missed it, man. Um, Hamza Mubarak, man. This um this um black guy was executed by a Palestinian street mob, man. Yeah, him, man. He was executed by a Palestinian street mob, man. Um <laughs> yeah, man. Woo. Yeah, man. Shout out to Mike, DC 100. Kick off the $5 challenge. Let's go. Yeah, let's also get to 200 likes, man, quickly, man. We on 104? My God. Let's get to 200 likes quickly. Everyone hit the like button. So yeah, this guy right here. Uh what's his name? Mubar. What's his name? Let me see. Hamza Mubarak, 31, man. Shout out. Society of Benevolence in the building. Op Nation Hall of Famer coming through once again. Hamza. Damn, Hamza. I wonder if this guy knows that black people over here fucking raising hell over Palestinians. <laughs> I think this guy knows that, man. You think this guy knows that? <laughs> I don't know what type of news they're getting. They are kind of like in the midst of something over there. <laughs> they got some shit going on over there. I don't know what kind of news they get in Palestine. 
But I wonder if this guy knows that. <laughs> Blacks over here raising hell for out for Palestine, man. <clears throat> I don't know. Maybe he knows, man. Maybe, maybe that's true. So this guy was um two days ago, he was executed by the Palestinian street mob. His hands were bound, his legs tied, he was hung upside down on a metal pole as hundreds of men cheered. His legs were then cut off and his body discarded like a pile of trash. In a pile of trash. Hamza was accused by Hamas. He and another man were accused by Hamas of being Israeli collaborators. So they accused this man of being an Israeli collaborator and executed him in the street. And it's being said that over there, they accuse people of being Israeli collaborators. Guess what, man? You're going to be shocked by this. This is everybody. Everybody get your bearings. I don't want anybody to, if anybody has a weak heart, um, I want you to get your bearings, man. You're not going to fucking believe this. Check this out. Check this out, man. The people that get accused of being Israeli collaborators in Palestine are gays, African Christians. <laughs> and people who interfere when Hamas wants to use their children as human shields. You're never going to fucking believe it, man. Gays, Africans, and Christians, man. And Arabs who don't want their children used as human shields. R.I.P. to the brother, man. He dead, man. He dead did a motherfucker, man. <laughs> that brother dead did a motherfucker. You heard? <laughs> yeah, man, they over there executing Africans, man, in the street, man. The only place that's going to cover that is here, man. You're not going to see that nowhere else, man. I hope it would be nice for other YouTube channels to cover that, but I don't know if they will, man. <laughs> 